This video is a short tutorial on the task manager in Windows 8. Uh, you get to it the same way you did in previous versions of Windows, either by hitting Control Alt Delete or right clicking on the taskbar and clicking on Task Manager. Now in Windows 8, uh, they've changed the look and uh, features of it, but it's basically the same. Uh, it'll list any uh, running applications you have. So here, I'm starting up Google Chrome. And if you switch back and look at the task manager, you can see it listed there. But you could also uh, get more features by clicking on more details. And this gives you a list of tabs up top and will show you uh, different functions of the task manager. And here it's different processes running in the background, including any active applications you have. And it shows you the resources they are using. You can also click on the performance tab, which is similar to... Uh, what it looks like in Windows 7 and XP. Uh, shows you CPU memory and disk access. Uh, and also here is a graph of your CPU usage. And if you right click on it, you can actually choose, choose either overall utilization or actually have it show your different uh, actual uh, processor cores. And we'll show you the uh, amount that each one is being used at the moment. Uh, there are, it's also a uh, different tabs up here, including details. Uh, which shows you all the different processes that are running, uh, if they're suspended or actually running, how much memory they're using. Uh, app history uh, basically shows you the uh, resources and different applications uh, in the uh, Windows UI uh, they've been running and if they've been suspended, how much CPU time and how many resources they've been using. Um, And if you click on the Startup tab, that will actually show you any applications that are set to start up uh, when you start up your Windows computer. If you like this video, uh, please give it a uh, thumbs up below. And also, if you like my videos, uh, I would encourage you to subscribe to my channel. Thank you.